game players, you're gonna love it. It's me, the Games Master, live here at the Game Lair, and I'm on my way to Westminster, Colorado for this, may I say, crazy episode of the Instant Replay and the most death-defying Primo show in a long time. And that's not the only reason why I'm excited. I'm excited because I have a very special guest joining me this month. It took a long time, but you know what? He said yes, and oh my God, it's gonna be a barn burner. Just like it always is on this program. But I'm not gonna tell you who it is. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm not gonna spoil the surprise. You're gonna have to wait and find out. So let's get this party started with our very first guest, Caleb Crush. of Colorado Professional Wrestling, and right now I'm backstage with the rules with the one and only Caleb Crush, and tonight Caleb is one of your biggest challenges so far in Lonnie Valdez. What do you have in store for Lonnie tonight? You know, I, I thought maybe Lonnie, I, I should take him out to dinner, you know, or I should maybe, you know, take him out to a nice meal, get some drinks, and I thought, you know, maybe I should just kick his ass. I'm thinking maybe I should take his head and stomp it into the bottom turn buckle. Or maybe I should hit him with my kaboom baby off the top rope. Now that kaboom that you have been hitting on people has taken a lot of people out for a long time. And now you're saying that you are going to do that too. Because we're talking a lot of trash a lot of in the list in the last few weeks leading up to this match. What is your rebirth? You know, it, uh, my feelings are hurt, you know. He used to be my buddy. He's not his friend anymore. You know, I, I don't know, my, my glasses are fogging up right now because because I'm so sad about it. I don't care about Lonnie Valdez. I'm going to show you how much I don't care tonight. By taking him on his head in the ground, when he looks up, he has my head raised in the air by the referee. You'll know Caleb Crush, the OC's finest, part of American Trash, me and Trey Jean. That's right, baby. So Trejon and this man right here, part of American Trash, the next champion of Primos. Who knows what could be happening? Caleb, thank you very much for taking time off. We'll have more. It is the one and only Jack Recital. Welcome to the Instant Replay, my friend. Oh, thank you. Games Master can only be an honor. Now, what are you doing? What is your main goal with your return to previous wrestling? And to cover the wrestling in general. What is your, what is your ultimate goal? My ultimate goal is to prove I'm simply the best here in Primo's wrestling. I am also goal oriented. So when it comes to that and proving that I am the best wrestler in the state, that is my goal. And who knows, once I reach that status to where every single person knows it, I still may never be satisfied. What will it take to satisfy the hunger that is inside of Jack Recital? You've held every title in color wrestling four times and I have fingers and toes. What is it that drives you to come back to Colorado wrestling? To be honest, I get, you know, I get bored sitting at home. This is where I belong in a room. Stretching someone, suplexing someone, hitting someone, throwing someone, taking someone else's. What title, if there is one, are you going to go for while you're here at Trinity? What is your main strap that you, Jack Messiah, are going to go for? Easy. Pretty much your way championship. I wouldn't. You just had a hellacious match with Tony Ortega, and you came up a little short. But this is only your first match back. What do you have to say? If there's anybody out there that's going to be in your crosshairs at the next show, what would you want to say to that? Returning Jack Besidel. A Jack Besidel who just lost. K 
can only mean one thing. He's also dangerous. Jack Seidel. The returning legend himself, Jack Masidal, right here on the history plate. There's more coming up, and we got a special guest later on. So stick right where you are. We have new tag team champions right here in the tournament field standing with them right now. Johnny Crash, Paul A.D., Marcus T. Lyon, they did it. Nobody thought they could do it, but they did it. Hey, hey, uh, hey, let's get a real manager in here right here. It's no wonder that Polly B and Johnny C are your new Korean Tag Team Champions. And you know, I don't care who the hell they put in this American trash. I don't give a crap. Well, hey, you know, first things first, we only have Holly Bell. So we have to hunt down Dalton Bragg, jump his ass, and then take it back for ourselves. And then we'll be much happier. Yeah. I don't know what you've been in this business for five, six, seven years. And this is probably one of the biggest titles that you've all been holding. It's true. And, and hey, it's true. Hey, say what you want to say. We got an after party to go to. Exactly. Peace out. Jager bombs for all. Yeah. The new tag team champions, Marcus E. Wright, right here on the Instant Replay. We'll be back with a special surprise. And here it is, ladies and gentlemen, the Games Master with the one and only Van Hardy V1. He's live here in Westminster at Primos. He just took on Rob Ryzen. Van Hardy, what were you trying to prove in your match against Rob Ryzen? Uh, you know, I see a ton of potential in Rob Ryzen. Uh, I think he's a great athlete. I think he's a great wrestler. And I, I think there's a good person there somewhere. I just wanted to push him to his limits. I wanted him to look in the mirror. I wanted him to realize being the best in your area, being brass in your area, doesn't mean you've done what you need to do to take that level to the very top stand in this game. Uh, Rob Ross has got a ton of potential. I want to go out, I want to push him, I want to try and make him better, and I think we did that today. Do you think that maybe you you showed him more than what he could, what he could handle in this match? I mean, you've been all over the world, you've been in many different federations, you came to Colorado to, for one reason and one reason only. Uh, no, I mean, I think he was really prepared for this match. He gave me a hell of a match. I mean. Uh, most guys couldn't get in a ladder match with me and go five minutes and it would be over. I mean, it's not an easy thing to do. I mean, to get Rob Rice in a checkmate position, it took me 25, 30 minutes. He's a hell of a tough guy. You can't take that away from him. I might not agree with everything he says, everything he thinks. I might not see eye to eye with him, but he's a tough guy. He's got a ton of potential. Just as long as he keeps his attitude, uh, as long as he gets his attitude adjusted and he keeps the attitude on the right track, he's gold in this business. He can, be, he can do great things. And what do you see for What do you see for Matt Hardy? Do you see Matt Hardy coming back to Colorado? Do you see Matt Hardy facing Rob Rising? And do you see Matt Hardy <laughs> facing anybody in Colorado again? My name is Matt Hardy, and anything, and I mean this, anything. Is possible. You never know where I'll pop up. Never say never about anything. Adios. I've enjoyed Colorado. I've enjoyed the interview. Thank you, sir. That's Matt Hardy right here on the History Replay. That was your surprise. I hope you like it. We're going to get one more interview with you right after this. Once again, the managerial face of Colorado Professional Wrestling, the Games Master, and his replay right here in Westminster, Colorado. And here I have Rob Ryzen, the one, the only Rob Ryzen, yeah, yeah, yeah. Who's ha who has been, shall we say, screwed out of the cash box. You know, I, I appreciate you kissing my ass. I really do. I love all the, all the different headlines. You see the Denver Daredevil, larger than life. The man who took Matt Hardy to his limits. I like all that. I like all that you just said. Did he say that? I'm pretty sure he said that. You know, I'm, I'm humbled. I'm humbled by Matt Hardy. I'm humbled by everything he did out there. I'm humbled by the ladder match. You know, I... 
I don't feel screwed at all. I just feel... I do feel screwed, as a matter of fact. You know what, Matt Hardy? That wasn't fair. You you, you had me thinking that you were going to be a good man and you were going to give me that cash pot briefcase back because I have earned it. I have truly earned it. And then you go and you give it to my arch rival. He gave it to my arch rivals, Jay Sin. Can you believe that? I couldn't believe it. I was, I was, I was stunned. Well, look, Matt, everything is far from over. I'm going to learn from my mistakes and I'm going to come back and I'm going to beat you again. But first... It's time to get my cash pot briefcase back That's right. from Jason. And you intend to do that in any way, any time, anywhere. Absolutely. That's it. I'm done. Ladies and gentlemen, Rob Ryzen, right here on the History Plate. Thanks for joining us. Well, there you have it, folks. A brand new edition of the Instant Replay. I'm the Games Master, the managerial face of Colorado professional wrestling, back here at the game layer after a crazy night at Primos. I want to take this opportunity to thank my special guest, Matt Hardy, for taking time out of his busy schedule to share a few words with me and with you. And I also want to remind you game players, if there's anything Games Master related you want, then head on over to my Game Master game page, fan page on Facebook. The link is right here. You'll just have to copy and paste it. And you can get anything, 8x10s, Shirts, action figures, everything Games Master is right here. So go over and check it out. Well, that concludes this edition of the Games Master Presents Insta Replay. And remember, if you missed the Insta Replay, you don't know what's going on. So until next time, this game is over. <laughs>